What's up, y'all? Oh my god. I am very tired today because I didn't get to sleep till around about 4 a.m. ish, and it's like something like 1 in the afternoon now, and I woke up at like 9 o'clock, so didn't get much sleep last night, but oh uh, well. But I need to clean my room because my room's kind of a tip right now, and it's just like stuff everywhere, so I'm gonna tidy that away. And then I'm gonna go for a walk, and um, probably a coffee alongside the way out as well, so that's what I'm gonna do today. And then, um, well, that's not today actually, this, this afternoon afternoon actually um but that's what i'm doing today so yeah follow me along all right so i've just cleaned my room right now it looks more better so yeah i'm happy but yeah i need to return a package to a store because i was like a pair of shorts um, a few days ago and they were like too big for me well they're not too big for me but they weren't really the right shape for me like it was like a really awkward kind of size and i did not look good in it so i'm gonna return it back today um yeah just a day of doing that and then i might get a coffee and go for a walk so yeah pretty good day ahead well actually not day afternoon actually because i woke up at like nearly noon which i hate doing so yeah okay so the bread's coming along very nicely like I made this bread last night for like 3 a.m. this morning actually, and it's coming along quite nicely. So, as you can see, the dough is raised quite good. It's like actually raised this time, which is actually really good because usually when I make bread and stuff, like, the dough doesn't really raise. Well, it does rise, but not as much as it did today, which I'm very happy about. So, hopefully, that should make bread. And I'll also a bit of pizza to well because I'm thinking about having pizza tonight for tea. So, we'll see about that. But. Um, yeah. Alright, so I think we're the two errands, but I'm in like three places and I've got fish and sauce, so um, I've got like a nice, like, motel and sauce, so it's actually good. It's tasty. It's actually good. It's actually good. It's actually good. It's actually good. Yeah. Okay, well in case you didn't catch any of what I said in there, it's like really loud and stuff, like I got like a new coffee thing for like a new coffee place which I've never actually been to before, so I'll just try it. So I ordered like an ice smoker with like extra caramel syrup like I usually do, but ice latte. And I've got it's like really cold as well, so it must be really good. Oh my god, yes. Wow, so freaking good. Um, well, okay, so that mocha was so good, except that it was a little bit too sweet, but it was still good, like, I actually loved it, but I think next time we'll just order, um, less caramel sauce. But yeah, it was, um, quite good if you ask me. Alright, so I've just turned the package right now, um, that's actually really good, but I'm in next right now, and I'm just looking at the homework a bit, because... I love the toilet guys as before, but I actually love like anything like homeware, like I actually love like interior design from that. So any sort of home store for me makes me like, really happy and I would literally be here like forever. Like I just love it so much. Okay, so it's like an hour later now and I'm at Aldi right now. I'm gonna shop for food and stuff so I need to go shopping for food and that's what I'm doing right now. So I'm along. <laughs> Okay, I'm home now from that shopping trip. So I done a food shop. So like two bags here full of food, which are really heavy. So I got stuff such as butter and milk and stuff. So um, yeah. <laughs> As for the bread though, it's looking quite nice. So here's what it looks like. So it's coming on quite a lot. So it has risen and it's a lot bigger now, but there are loads of bubbles as well. So yeah, it's quite a thick dough. It's really wriggly. It can do all well the things. So I think I'm gonna make pizza dough first. And if there's any dough left, I might make bread with it. I'm not sure. But I actually think I'll scrap the pizza dough idea because um, yeah, for me out of time, but with all this dough, I think I'm gonna make bread with it because I always want to like make like really good bread with this thing, so that's what I'm gonna do right now, so yeah. Okay, right, so I'm gonna open this flour up right now. Um, this is a fresh bag of flour because I had no flour in last night, hence why I didn't make cookies, which 
um, was a very much a pain because I make cookies like every night, but then to have it like taken away from you because you have no flour was a bit of a thing last night. Anyway, just flouring the surface to put the bread dough on. Okay, so here's what the thing looks like already. So it looks good. It's very sort of flat, like it's very sort of bendy and movie and face sort of runny. Um, but I guess that's all right. So um, yeah. So I'm gonna put this thing in this little tray right now, and then life should be good. Da, 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 da. So we have my bread here, which looks really good actually. So yeah, I'm actually quite pleased with it. Yeah. So that's good to kind of eat with a, as a snack later on. And then I've made my own butter as well. So that looks good as well. Like this is my first time making my own butter. And it was super easy to make as well. So to make butter, you just literally use like a pot of double cream and you put it in the whisk, preferably on an electric whisk or else be the whisk in with your hands for quite some time. But you put the whisk on like the highest setting and then you just let it whisk and let it whisk until it becomes like scrambled eggs, basically. And the double cream looks really like hard and feels hard. And you take it out there and just mold it with your hands into like a buttery kind of block and put it in like really cold water afterwards, mold it again. And then that's it, like it becomes butter then. And if you want to add salt and things like that, then you just put the salt in and mix the salt in the butter. And it's really easy. So yeah, I'm actually quite pleased with it actually. Okay, it is much later now. And I'm having tea at 11 o'clock at night because I didn't get to have tea at tea time because I was busy cleaning my oven out like I was like doing the hack where you put the oven racks in like a bathtub full of like dishwashing tablets and like I scrubbed the oven like racks and it kind of looks good not gonna lie but you know trying to like do several things at once I'm trying to vlog trying to cook tea trying to boil rice um do all the things so yeah so this is a chili bowl with rice. And I got this from like Poppy Cooks. Like she made like a video, I think it was like a sponsor for Morrison's and she made this like video of like this like chili bowl. Now I don't have chili but I decided to put peppers in there instead. And hopefully it should still taste pretty good. I've got some garlic bread in the oven right now. Ready, I'm waiting to be eight. Da -da -da -da. I'm gonna sprinkle a bit of cheese on there. There we go. What's up guys? So it's a few days later now when I'm editing this vlog and the vlog kind of ended on a bit of a sad note because um basically I was that night I was looking back on some old TikToks, like of my old likes videos and old TikToks and stuff and I just felt really nostalgic about like last year's TikToks and about all the happy memories that were associated with me and um, when I watched those TikToks, if you know what I mean. And I kind of felt a bit sad because I've been f out for, la for those two days, like, I was feeling quite miserable and quite tired and sad and stuff. So I think to look back on like 2021's TikToks and remember all the good times and how happy I was. Well, I'm still happy now, but... For those two days when I'm vlogging, when I was vlogging this vlog, I was kind of miserable. So I uh, was looking back on those TikToks and it kind of made me feel sad because to look back on those TikToks and I was so happy and all the happy memories. And then obviously I was looking back on it when I was quite miserable and it just kind of made me a bit sad and I don't know. But yeah, but I'm much happier now, obviously, as you can see. Well, well, but... Um, yeah, so that's why I didn't end up vlogging the rest of that vlog because I was just um, quite sad and nostalgic over stuff. And usually, usually I like to look back on old like memories and stuff, but I think obviously, like I said, I was quite miserable that day. So to look back on old memories of when I was happy kind of made me a bit... Uh. But anyway, I hope you guys liked watching this vlog anyhow. 
and I'll see you guys in another vlog. Hopefully the vlogs and um, the vlogs will be much more happier and much more upbeat. So um, yeah, here's to that. So yeah, bye. <laughs>